that, uh, that could make it for a few passes today going astray. Bartley with the throw, Clayton Blackmore, losing out to Wegerty. Bailey's gone racing it in the middle, Sinton's in there too, Barker's in there, Sinton with a shot, and Rangers are in the lead. Andy Sinton, his first lead goal of the season. And coming inside the first five minutes after four, in fact, Really was very much bad marking from United, and Sinton just knocked the ball into the back of the net. But they broke so well. Look at this as they're coming in. You'll see Sinton completely marked, unmarked, on his own there to knock it in. I think Barclays are running a fastest goal of the day award. I'm not quite sure that Sinton's will get it because I think Luton scored in the first minute at Nottingham Forest. Uh, as far as I can gather, one here's Bailey, and that could so easily be another one. This is incredible! A wonderful start by Queen's Park Rangers. Really Andy won. Sinton's goal, followed by one now by Dennis Bailey. But it was it was Bailey's power, wasn't it? Shoved on Blackmore to knock it into the net, and absolute disastrous start for Manchester United. Power, really. Look at the power here. I mean, very strong. Just shoved them off. Slot it. It may be unlucky, Michael, and not. No. And uh, the worried features there, the shot features really there. Just keeping it in play. Wegley's joined him up the front there. So is Ian Holloway here. That's a good strike oh. by Holloway. Well, he struck it very firmly and uh, extremely firmly indeed. I mean, must be 30 years out, not far no away. away, was it? Peacock. Oh, that's a good ball there. And he's in there too. Let's see. Well, that was as close as it could be without actually being in the net. And another lovely Queen's Park Rangers move that sliced open the United defence. But the Bailey again, so fast. I mean, the United defence stopped it. I was very unlucky there just to knock it over the car. Gentle. It's a throw for QPR, which David Barnsley will take. Barnsley, long, long cross towards Sinton. Bailey again, Bailey. The flag is up on the far side. Some good work by Schmeichel. A half-time whistle. And what a surprising first half it's been. Unless you were actually here or watching the first full. 45 minutes and realize that in fact Queen's Park Rangers thoroughly deserving to be in front both their goals coming in the opening five minutes of the game Andy Sinton the first Dennis Bailey the second and a lot of work for Manchester United to do in the second half so that's the halftime situation here at Old Trafford Welcome back. Well, before the match, Ryan Giggs received his Young Eagle of the Month award, arrested, of course, by Alex Ferguson today. But with United trailing 2-0, I wonder if he'll be making an appearance before too long. Let's rejoin Brian Moore. Thanks a lot, Elton. For these first-half statistics, the one that really stands out are shots. Two for Manchester United, seven for Queen's Park Rangers. And I gather of those two shots for Manchester United, not one of them actually was on target. McGregor wearing the, he's carrying the number seven board. And so it'll be Mike Phelan who comes off any moment now. Well, Mike, he's not, he's not gone into the game, has he? Uh, and they need something like that, to need something like Giggs to try and get past uh, Wilson on this left-hand side and get the ball into Hughes and McLeod. Hughes. Ince. In goes Barker. Blackmore. A long-range shot too high. There's a bit more purpose about United in this second half. They're going to make the substitution now as Phelan comes off. And Giggs comes on, gets a roar of approval from the crowd. And young Ryan Giggs is on. And we get the mouth-watering prospect now of Sharp and Giggs in the same attack for Manchester United. Giggs, in fact, has gone to a fairly central position. Stay score with the Kick. Barker. Barnsley. Look at Bailey again. And Sinton. 
Strong shot, well saved. Missing great holes in that Manchester United defence again. Well, again, I mean, um, completely on Mark Bailey. Nice knockback to Sinton and a ferocious shot. A, a lovely save for this man. Here's Bailey again. And this time, it's in there. so close to goal number three a moment ago and no sooner were we off the replay than there was Bailey prancing through again and this time making no mistake well I mean he's as you say Brian he's threatened I mean two or three times but uh, he's such a uh, powerful strong player look at the old Ballester lovely a uh, lovely chip beautiful goal here. well I think there might be a fair chance today that they might just do it what do you think Brian must really favour them and the travelling QPR fans are now chanting we want four yeah, such is their form at the moment you really wouldn't put that past them at the moment good bit of play by uh, Parker Ryan Giggs again <laughs> lovely little drag back of his what about this now he goes through there was a foul right on the edge of the box now Blackmore's behind us Giggs is behind us Mr. Jostling there, Giggs floating it in, and Bardsley with the header for QPR. Webb knocking it back in again, up goes Peacock, gets the header in. Claim a handball, referee didn't want to know about it. Parker playing it wide for Ryan Giggs again. Getting it into Pallister, it's Peacock up there again. I was just going to say it was a marvellous one. I thought he might have passed it Bailey before, but he elected out the shot. A bit lucky coming back off the post, but uh, it really was a marvellous, magnificent one. And a good shot. So, and, I, and I was just going to say, I don't think there's any doubt. I mean, there was, because there's two or three players in the QP. Bailey up front has been absolutely superb. He's good. Pallister and Bruce are, are a horrendous time, really. Look at the three matches. Got play there. A lovely turn there, and he beats uh, Bruce and Ryan. Well, he set up a super chance there for Roy Waverley. In moment, sums up Manchester United's day. And his day has been totally different. Bubbly goes to Dennis Bailey. Well, it's not bad, is it? Scoring a hat to get Old Trafford. There's the full-time whistle. The championship still with a lot to play for. The most astonishing result of the season so far with Queen's Park Rangers, few have given them a chance, coming here and winning by four goals to one with Dennis Bailey, the hat-trick man. Everything set in motion in just the third minute of the game and Andy Sinton scored four Rangers and Brian McClare making the low reply from Manchester United side that was sadly off song on this important day at the start of 1992. Here's the hat-trick man with Gary Newbon. Dennis, what a day for you. You've never played here before, have you? No, that's right. I haven't played here. First, first game at Old Trafford. Absolutely fantastic for you. Yeah, enjoyed every minute of it. Why were Queen's Park Rangers able to make such a quick start and play so well today? Well, we're ten games, well, six games on, on the beat at the moment, and we're playing good football. So uh, we came to this game confident to win. I'll tell you what, it's a bit different than Birmingham City and Bristol Rovers, all this, isn't it? Well, Birmingham City was good, but this is different class, first division. Oh, this is great. Well, well, here's the champagne. You're the man of the match. Did you hear the announcement about that? I did, yeah. yeah so thanks a lot for great supporters. And, uh, well, Happy New Year for my mum. Happy New Year for you, certainly, as well. Well done, Dennis.